Hey guys, welcome back to Magic TV. My name's Craig. It is nine o'clock on a Wednesday and it's time for a Hidden Gems. Now, Hidden Gems is one of my favourite videos of the week right here on Magic TV. What is it? Well, I take a deep dive, well, not deep dive, but I give you a look at a trick that came out years ago that maybe I think that you haven't seen before. Uh, and I think it's really important that I do these videos because as an industry, we stand on the shoulders of giants. And there's some amazing magicians that have come before us that have performed some amazing magic. And the problem is a lot of magicians will race out to do the latest and the greatest trick. And they won't look back at the tricks that came out 10, 20, 30 years ago, 40 years ago. And a lot of the time, they're the best tricks that have ever been released. And today I have a perfect example of that because today we're going to be looking at a trick by the late, great Max Maven. It's probably one of the tricks that he's most known for. Here we go. So today I'm going to be looking at B-Wave by, uh, by Max Maven or Jumbo B-Wave. This particular version is now B-Wave you can get from a lot of different shops. Jumbo B-Wave, which is what you're going to see a performance of in a minute is specifically through Mir Yadid Magic. So you can go to Mir Yadid Magic and you can get access to Jumbo B-Wave. Now, what is Jumbo B-Wave or B-Wave? Well, basically it is an iconic routine. Uh, Close-up magicians and stage magicians have been using it for years. It's just simply brilliant and a perfect example of Max's genius thinking. I'm gonna do a performance of this so you can actually see it in action. Let's have a look at a performance of B-Wave. And then after that, we'll talk about why it's so good. So uh, I've got um, an envelope. You have. And this is all about using your imagination. Okay. I want to imagine well, that inside, help, <laughs> I want to imagine that inside this envelope, there are, uh, there are four cards, four big cards. It doesn't take much of an imagination. I was gonna say, what because... are we imagining? There are. These are four cards. I want to imagine that there are actually four queens. Hold your hands out for me. I'll put them right here like this, like you're in a little table. Oh, okay. That's it. That's perfect. So I want to imagine that they're the four queens. It should be a good poker hand in most games. Yeah. So you've got the four queens here. Now, this is all about using your imagination. So I want to imagine that I can reach in and take out two of the queens. Okay. So really imagine that there's two queens here, and I'll help you. They're both the same colour. So have I, uh, have I removed the red queens or the black queens? Red. You've got red in your hand. Okay. So I'm going to mix them up so we don't know which one's which. And then I'll turn one over and I put them back in. So now we've taken one of those red queens, turned it over, and it's gone back into the pack, which is the red, uh, which is the red queen that we turned over. Diamonds. Really? And that happened completely in your imagination, didn't it? Yeah? Yeah. Here's what's interesting. I should tell you that it was the queen of diamonds. That, that was the one that was turned over in this pack. Which is, to hold this. No. which is amazing but what's even more amazing is i knew that you'd go for the queen of diamonds you know how i knew that it's got a red back the queen of diamonds is the only one with a red back and just in case there was any doubt i didn't bother with any of the other queens they are all blank i'm still fooling <laughs> so that's B-Wave or Jumbo B-Wave. As I say, this particular version, the Jumbo B-Wave, you can do to big audiences. You can do it to a parlor show audience. You can do it to uh, a cabaret show audience. No problem at all. Now, the... Um, uh, the what was I going to say? Oh yeah, sorry. <laughs> you can do it to a cabaret audience. You can do it to as many people as you want to. Absolutely no problem. Ryland in his state, one of his stage shows, he actually uses B Wave. These jumbo cards are amazing because you can see them from a distance. And and really, whether you're using B Wave or Jumbo B Wave, think of the impossibility of this for a minute. There's four cards. They freely think of one of them, and then with no moves, you can show that the card they're thinking of is reversed in the pack, and then. You can show it's got a different colored back and then you can show all the other cards are blank now there's been so many variations of this over the years but the original in many ways is still the best it is so clear it is so direct it is so simple and it's so powerful it's a great way to lead into other card magic by just literally taking out four cards and putting them down and saying look just name a card boom 
the card that you named is the one that's reversed in the pack. It's brilliant. Um, and really, I, you know, I'm not just saying this. People that are watching this, if you're not really aware too much of Max Maven's work, you should go check out everything he's done. But B-Wave is a fantastic place to start. A lot of people say to me, oh, I'm a close-up magician and I want to um, transition to doing stage magic. What's the best way to do that? Well, the best way to do it is to get tricks that pack small and play big. And one of the best tricks that pack small and plays big is B-Wave. If you get this jumbo B-Wave for me, you did magic, it will play to a massive audience. But it's also the sort of trick that you could do one-on-one -on -one on intimately it's just a brilliant trick and it's a great opener into a card set or into a mentalism set so this week's hidden gems is b-wave so there you go guys that's another hidden gems in the bag do me a favor let me know what you think in the comments down below now obviously if you want to see more videos like this you can like the video subscribe to the channel leave a comment down below if you want to get b-wave you can get it from all good magic dealers jumbo b-wave is available from mere you did magic uh and don't forget if you want to join the net tricks you can do so by going to www.thenettricks.com that's www.thenettricks.com i'm going to be back again tomorrow with a stack load more videos so thanks once again for joining me my name's craig from matt Check. Mm -hmm.